Okay, so let's see what we got in the land of wonder here. We got a fairly complex scene. I mean, fairly complex guy here with the UVs going all the way around his legs. Um, but it's still not unwrapping quite right because, you know, there's a lot more seams to put in here. So I'm just looking for kind of an extraordinary vertice in an area when it dead ends. And right here's one. Ends right there. Okay, so that'd be a great place to put a seam. So I'm like separating his top and bottom side a little bit there. Okay. And every once in a while, I, I just kind of check if I'm on the right path. Here, I'm just going to lop off his head here. And let me undo that for a sec. Uh, reason being that he has an armor piece in this area, so I'm going to take advantage of that and lop off his head here. Okay, then I'm going to take and separate his head into a quarter cut. Okay, let's uh, L, U, unwrap. And you can see I got some debacleness going around in here, but I get some pretty nice pieces so far. Okay, where that's failing is the fact that I have this other leg that's causing all this trouble. Okay, so I'm going to completely cut off the leg. I'm just looking for a good seam to do that in. Here's where that that one feature right here doesn't mesh well. So I'm going to turn it off real quick. So I can actually see what I'm doing. Okay, so there's that bottom half leg. So anytime you have maybe two forms that meet and they're kind of on top of each other, that's where that one needs to be turned off. I'll turn it back on so you don't so you can see what I'm doing. I know it's probably easier for you to watch this in the video if it's on. So that should separate the arms. Again, LU unwrap. And now I got these two arms. I'm going to have to separate the hands too, it looks like. Okay, so lots to do. I'll start with these arms first. And I could I could describe navigating in Blender kind of like 
swimming upstream in jello. So. It's it's amazing how powerful this program is and it's all free. I think the only thing that's hurting it is its its navigation. And um certainly the button structure leads much to be desired. Well, other than that, awesome program. I don't know how you would revamp it. And I don't know if I want somebody to revamp it. I've gone across, accustomed to its screwiness sometimes. Again, I like to lop off the hands and feet here. Man, what video could you ever say that in, right? doing a video tutorial on mortuary science or something like that maybe I'm just gonna lop off its head and throw it over here onto this UV map or yeah it just doesn't doesn't get announced very well in a video unless you're doing UVs I guess all right so here is L you unwrap and you can see now I'm getting all kinds of nifty, nice little pieces out here. Here is a thing of ugliness, so. And again, I'll turn on Sync UV here to kind of look at where this patch is located here. Oh, it's the arm yet. Okay, so. And I'm just making sure that loop goes all the way around. Sure enough, it does. I think it's these arms are still adhered to the body, and that, yeah, they are. That's what's going on. Okay. Now I'm going to take advantage of their uh, shoulder piece in this area, so I'm going to hide my seam behind it. Okay, starting to get better. Again, with Sync UV on, let's look at what this is. And right here, it's not being detached from the body. You can see that it doesn't end well. Okay, so.
good. All the pieces look good. Um, I would say there is some that need to be helped a little bit. In other words, there's a seam right here that I don't understand why it even exists. So I'm going to kind of patch that up. It exists on... this edge. So what I'm going to do is take this and complete it. And that will allow me to maybe eliminate an edge altogether. I don't know if I can... Yeah, I can quickly highlight that one. Okay, but at the very end, I'm going to have to take and cut a relief here. Okay, let's look how that looks. Wow, that looks so much better. Now I can understand this is the bottom side of the character. I can see the tail. All these parts are looking very, very nice. And that's the way they should. They should look the way they sh they look on the character. If they if they're not looking that way, I know that I did something wrong. So this is where the head goes in here. All right, I'm very happy with that. Okay, in the next video, we'll move on to the next chunk. Actually, this is the most complex chunk, so the other chunks are very easy to do, so I'll just run through them very quickly.